Canelo Kovalev. There's so many fights I want to. Ain't got so many fights I want to pick your brains at. Yeah. Obviously, I, when that fight was initially announced, I said, look, let's give Kovalev a bit more time to rest. Yeah. I think that round eight against Yard was too much, but the fight's happening nonetheless. Canelo's jumping up two weight classes. Like, I kind of feel like my suspicions are aroused as to how he gets up to two weight classes comfortably. Agreed. Um, what do you make of that fight? Interesting fight. Um, mm. A fun fight. Yeah. I'm looking forward to it. Some people have met it with a bit of scepticism, but uh, I'm looking forward to it for yeah. sure. Agreed. Um, I think. The whole Canelo moving up two weights is, yeah, it's um, people have their questions, mm. but because it's not even at a catch weight, is it? It's no, literally it's, just it's, yeah, it's moving up to one seven five. Yeah. Normally, be like oh, like one seven two or yeah. something, just to drain him a couple of pounds. Like, no, one seven five. Straight up to one seven five. I heard there's a rehydration clause though. Right. Okay. Yeah, I heard there's a Didn't rehydration clause, yeah. which fucking annoys the fuck out of me. If I'm honest with you. Yeah, that's gonna drain Kovalev. Yeah, bad. but um, Kovalev. I mean, against Yard, he Kovalev, looks, Kovalev must, must look at him like. You little midget. Yeah. You can't beat me. Got the Honestly. Win. I mean, I'm sure he'll still think that, yeah. Yeah, like... He towers over him. Yeah, so towers. Literally. Yeah. But I just think that, like, there is this saying that, you know, if you target Kovalev's body, that mm. will take him out. But how many people have took Kovalev out to the body? It's funny. It, 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 it's funny, isn't it? Because the way they talk about it, you'd act like he's been knocked down to the body like 20 times. Yeah. Like he's an Anne Khan or something. Yeah. He's not that guy. When I had Tunde on here, Tunde said that he was with um, Kathy Duva in the lift. Um, after the fight and they, they asked them are you worried about Kovalev this is what Tunde asked Kathy Duva and she said no she said if Tunde, if um, Yard's punches can't put Kovalev down they don't expect Canelo's to yeah. and they said Yard's a cruiserweight Yard's massive Yard's massive and they said if Yard can't put him down why should a 160 guy be able to put him down yeah. that's their thinking and that because makes sense at the end of the day who was Canelo bowling over at 160 this is it he's not bowling it's funny I mean, he's bowling over Amir Khan but I mean Amir yeah, Khan don't, don't mention Rocky Fielding yeah, that don't count. Yeah, like, who just says that Chavez he couldn't bowl over? Yeah, yeah. Didn't bowl over Triple G. No. Kovalev Jacobs didn't bowl didn't over. Didn't bowl him over. Yeah. He's going. He's going the distance. But you know what it is? It's that round eight where Kovalev is literally wobbling and Yard's catching him. I was thinking, oh my god, I thought that was it. Then everyone thought he was done. Like, yeah. And I'm thinking if Canelo gets him in that position, Canelo will just pick his punches a bit better than Yard. Yeah. And Yard was kind of swinging a bit towards the end there, just I think trying to that land was one. Inexperienced, wasn't yeah. it? Yeah. If, if Canelo gets him where he needs to land one clean. Canelo will land one clean. I think Canelo, I, I love watching him. Yeah. I think he's like technically yeah, cheap though, isn't he? Well, yeah, he is. Yeah, he is it's been proven. Yeah, fuck it, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's true. That's not me yeah. to say it. That's yeah, we can't even deny it. We can't even deny it. I forgot that. I, I, love I, I, I love watching him. I think his well. skills are brilliant, but mm. yeah, at the end of the day, you're a drug cheat. Yeah. Um, you're going to get away with it because you're like the face you of boxing. You are the face much. of boxing. Which is. He is fantastic though. As much as I say that, and I will say this in saying that I think most boxers at that level probably do stuff. If yeah, I'm yeah, you, agreed. Because they know when their fights are going to be. Yeah. He is unreal. Yeah. Like that resume now is just getting ridiculous now. I agree. I mean, his last four or five fights now will be two against GGG. A move up and wait, Rocky Fielding, I know, doesn't really count. Um, Danny Jacobs and now Canelo. I'm sorry, Kovalev. Kovalev. 